Now press you two. The elbow pad out of cardboard. You want to save your elbows while you're doing handyman work or working around the house? Stand by. Now press you two. The cardboard elbow pad. Stand by. I'll show you how. Just cut the flaps off here. We're making the elbow pad out of cardboard. Some idea how full we want this to come. So from the wrist all the way past the elbow, probably about a couple of inches. Uh, we cut. You guys may be a little shorter or longer, but um, we're going to take that. Then we're going to take our cutting board, just a piece of platform. And we're going to take and put our arm down and right above the wrist and probably a couple of inches past the elbow I'm going to measure give you some idea so this is long enough for me you have maybe a little shorter or longer but um, we're going to take that then we're going to take our cutting board just a piece of platform And we're going to take Look like that. <clears throat> Make sure it bends. I'm going to roll it the other way also. Take and move it. You want to make sure it rolls up. Take and roll it up. Like that. Press on it. Hold it back out. Same thing the other way. Gonna take and cut some slits in opposite direction, long ways. Wanna make this as flexible as possible. So these slits are gonna make it very flexible. Put it on your arm and get some idea. Okay. Then we're going to take the other pieces that we cut off, the other sections. Just going to cut pieces. About this long. Just do the same thing all the way down.
We're gonna need about maybe 30 of these. Maybe not, let's see. Well, it depends. Not 30. We're gonna cut about, let's see, got five. This is gonna be the cushion. I'm gonna give you the cushion when you got your elbow down. It's gonna lay these out. Don't have to be perfect. I'm gonna cut them out here. Line them up. They're gonna be taped to the back. Trying to get one more cut out. Make that flat again. I'm gonna take our tape. <clears throat> gonna take our clear tape and put it down the middle first. Line them up. So they won't be moving around. Okay, once we get our pieces cut, line them up, tape it to that, we're going to take and cut a piece of cardboard. You want to measure around your arm here, um, around your, right above your wrist and above your forearm, how wide you need this to be. All we're gonna do, we'll take our cutter board again. Just need two pieces, one for the bottom, one for the top. So you can slash it across. Nothing fancy, just sort of make a circle. Make it comfortable. Okay, take and roll it up. Same with the other one. It's going to measure around your arm. I'm going to take and wrap this. I already have one made here. I'll take and wrap it. Accordingly, pin it on how wide your forearm is, and it basically take a tape and wrap it around it, so it'll stay. This is just going to slide. You're going to do the top and the bottom the same way. It's going to slide up your arm and over your elbow. This is what's going to save the elbow. You're a handyman, you're on your back doing a project. This is going to save your elbow. Real simple project to make. Keep it um, with your toolbox on your tool chest and use it when you're ready to use it. But um, this is a real simple elbow protector. 
Stand by the virtually two. They are both protector. Okay, we have both the little arms made here, so right where the elbow is gonna bend, we're gonna cut a a V right here. Cut that out. That's what I did. Do the other side. Same thing with the other one. Anniversary 2. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. See you through the elbows.